What's up everybody, D'Angelo here, and I wanted to do a quick update on this account here or whatnot and talk about shaving. So a lot of people don't know about shaving and they actually don't know that network shaved them or whatnot. And you know, the last video I had just made over here, if you had watched that or whatnot, if you see this is a video, it says $21 right here. Okay, so that number is gonna be important here in a second. But um let's see here. So you see or whatnot, the last video, I think it was at what was it? Um $47. Okay, so it was at $55 so far. I let it go up like another couple of dollars or whatnot, and then I switched it over. I switched out the link and put it over here on Cash Network. Now this is this is every single network, guys. Every single network shaves you. Now, PureFly for some reason is shaving extremely hard right now. Because I'm sending some traffic over or whatnot. And in the back end, my EPC is higher than over here on um, Cash Network. But I'm also not receiving a lot of clicks. So, you know, that's extremely weird. Because I'm still spending the same amount of money and everything is exactly the same. I just switched out the links. So I just, you know, decided to switch the link back really quick to see what was going on. See if anything had changed or if, if Facebook, you know, or my landing page, I mean, uh, yeah, my landing page wasn't doing so good anymore and I just wasn't getting clicks. So I switched it and for the entire day, so this was like from last night at like 12 o'clock all the way until, so basically it was like, I want to say like 20 hours, it made 64 bucks. I switched off the link and put it back over to Cash Network. It made eighty dollars, well, like eighty-three bucks in the course of one hour. Okay, so yeah, that's a huge difference right there. So, guys, network shave. Every single network shave is just that simple. They don't give you credit for all of your leads. Okay, now the reason why I believe I don't know if this is a hundred percent, but the reason why I believe that network shave is to cover their own ass. So, let's say you got two markers. One is doing really good, and then the other one is sending a bunch of shit traffic and fake traffic or bot traffic or anything like that, okay? Now, they're going to take leads from everybody, you know, whether they're doing good or bad, they're going to shave every single person. And then the person who has good leads and stuff like that, you know, that'll cover the person who sent a bunch of shitty traffic. So it kind of just balances the, balance the board out, okay? But, I mean, they do this with every single offer, every single network. It's not just PureFly. It's not just Cash Network. You know, every single network does this. Max Bounty, uh, Never Blue, you know, XY7 Elite, every single network, guys, okay? Um, it's just the way that it goes, especially email submits, okay? You do not get paid for them submitting their email, okay? It's just that simple. I'm going to come right out with it, guys. Like, oh, I shouldn't say every single one is like that, but 9 out of 10 of them, you do not get paid as soon as they put their email in there. They have to put their email in there, then they put in their uh, information, click a few buttons or something like that, then you get paid, okay? Now, they, the advertiser, you know, when you do email submits, even though you they're putting their email in there, you don't get paid for that, okay? But the advertiser will get their email and be able to sell them on the back end using their email and everything like that, you know, using their follow-up series and stuff like that. And, you know, even though I'm telling you this, it's extremely hard to be able to just go out and do it. That's the reason why I started creating the um, the Team D'Angelo um, email website or whatnot, so that way you guys can be able to do that as well. Because it is extremely difficult when it comes to doing emails and stuff like that with CPA. They have to buy domains, and, you know, you got to test things out, you got to make sure everything's working. But that's for a different video, okay? But you don't get paid for every single email that goes in, for every single lead that goes in. And it doesn't matter if it's an email submit, a download, app install. You know, it doesn't matter what type of offer. Even those trial offers where people spend $5, you know, and stuff like that, they don't go through every single time for that reason because they're shaving you. It's just that simple. It's just that simple. You know, I don't even know why they call it shaving. You know, just a lot of marketers call it shaving. So there we go. But guys, you know, you just got to go through each network, okay? So like this network, you know, for this particular offer, because it's different for every offer, guys. So let me throw that out there as well. Okay, so let's say I'm doing an offer over here on Cash Network, you know, and like this offer right here, for example. Okay, let's say I'm doing this offer right here, you know, um, the coach one or whatever, and I do the same thing on here. Same landing page, same traffic source, same everything, just switch out the links. And let's say it does really good over here on PureFly, but it does really shitty over here on uh on Cash Network, okay? Like that happens, guys. Sometimes it's not your 
web page, I mean your landing page, it's not your traffic source, it's your affiliate, I mean it's your CPA network that you're going through. Because I've actually had stuff like that happen before. Like with Max Bounty for uh, for instance, I had an offer on there that ran really, really, really shitty. Okay, I just switched out the links. I had one that it had went 300 clicks without a single conversion, guys. 300 clicks of high quality traffic. 300 clicks without a single conversion. And I told the affiliate manager, my links are broken. Like, I don't go like zero like that. Like, that doesn't happen. Those links are broken. He's like, oh, no, they're fine. You know, blah, blah, blah. Comes out to find out they were broken. And, you know, I never got paid for any of those leads that I sent over. And then when I put it up back up again, it still wasn't crediting every single one or whatnot. And I was still getting shaved extremely hard over there. So then I switched the links back over to Cash Network, you know, and never blew. Just like that, everything's golden. So like this was just a perfect example. Cause I mean, like I said, it's been it's like 20 hours or whatnot it took to make $64. And then I switched the links out. And then over here on Cash Network, it made $80 in the course of what is that? When did I make this? Well, it doesn't tell me exactly how long ago I went. To, I made this or whatnot, but it's been about a good hour or two or whatnot since I made since I switched out that link or whatnot. I'm gonna say about a good hour, but either way, it made more money in an hour or or two in the course that it took this to make twenty hours. So think about all that money that I lost. I probably lost a couple hundred dollars on here because I just and I would have never known if I didn't test it. Okay. Guys, you gotta be in multiple different networks so you can test things out to see if it's working. Cause if it just because it says that you got a hundred clicks or whatnot, and let's say, you know, in the back office here, it'll say you got a hundred clicks. That doesn't mean you only got a hundred clicks. You can contact your affiliate manager and stuff like that if this does happen. You know, you just want to test things out. That's why I always have to make sure my members or tell my members use bit.ly. Uh, links and stuff like that because let's say on average you get like 30 percent okay if 100 people goes to your landing page uh let's say 50 people 50 uh people go through and 30 people you know complete the offer then you know let's you just you'll know you have your numbers there you'll know what to do and things like that so when something like this happens you're like hmm, that just seems really out of the ordinary for me to be sending all this traffic but in the back office i'm only seeing 100 clicks you know, so I'm just thinking, okay, you know, maybe the traffic slowed down or something like that. And then I just got charged another couple hundred from Facebook. And I'm like, that's weird. You know, I just lost a couple hundred dollars. Why? I mean, I'm thinking maybe Facebook just stopped or something like that. Because, you know, I can't check it right now because it's running on someone else's account. So I'm sitting here like, hmm, maybe it's just not, maybe it's just, you know, doing this thing or whatnot. And I have to wait a couple of days or a day for the ads to go back up. So I get charged randomly. So I switch the links out and stuff like that. And as you can see, guys. A huge difference or whatnot one hour 20 hours okay so just really check them out guys you know like I said I haven't really touched base on shaving and stuff like that because I mean I really didn't think about it until just now but really 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 check your numbers guys like I mean this could be happening to people right now I mean, like I said, it's not always the traffic source. Like people think, oh, the traffic source, the traffic source, the traffic source, you know, the landing page, landing page. Like, honestly, guys, it really doesn't matter about your landing page. OK, I mean, obviously, you want a really decent landing page or whatnot. If you're using paid traffic, you want to use a paid landing page. You don't want to use like something from Weebly or something like that. But, you know, it really doesn't matter about the landing page because why do people get scammed? You know, like if they like people get scammed literally every single day. If they can get scammed from some shit that's like clearly a scam, like you can tell somebody, hey, I'll give you $10,000 if you give me $1,000 uh, today, I'll turn it into 10000 in three days. Like how ignorant does that sound? Like they ask no questions, but they can do that. No problem. You think they're not going to click on something that says free and that they're going to get money for free or, you know, they're going to get this for free. You know, okay. Doesn't matter. But yeah, guys. Definitely make sure you join multiple networks so that way you can test your landing pages. I mean, test out the offers because, like I said, it could be vice versa, guys. Like, I'm not saying that it's every offer on Purefly sucks. I'm not saying every offer on Cash Network sucks. I'm not saying every offer on Max Bounty, Never Blue, XY7, you know, and so on suck. I'm saying that every single network does shave you out your stuff. So, I mean, it's not all about the payout as well, okay? 
because let's say it pays out um a hundred dollars for an offer on cash network and then let's say on purefly it pays out seventy dollars now let's say you got the same amount of traffic and stuff like that you might you can there's a possibility that you'll make more money with the person with the network that's paying out seventy dollars instead of a hundred dollars because you know they are less likely to shave you or whatnot because of the um because they're paying out less and they're making more money okay but like I said guys it all depends you know like I mean it all depends like I'm not saying any one network is better than other or whatnot like from here as you can see purefly screams they want money okay so I mean you can really see that they really want money because I mean 20 hours you know 64 bucks and one hour 80 bucks or whatnot so, you know, that really screams like a huge difference or whatnot. Like I wouldn't even run that offer on here again, but I mean, that doesn't stop me. I could run another offer on there, you know, that I don't have connections to. So let's say um, I want to run an offer for, I don't know, like a skin product or something like that. Normally you have to be making, you know, you know, a really a lot of mo a lot of money or whatnot to just go up to them directly. That's why they have C CPA networks to begin with, because, you know, if you're person that's only making like a grand a week i mean you don't really have any pool you like oh yeah i make a thousand dollars a week they're making millions okay so i mean they don't really care you're on at least hundreds of thousands of dollars or whatnot so that's just some food for thought guys definitely make sure you test it out um check and see if you're getting shaved um because i mean it could be on just don't focus on just one network guys okay like i said it could be vice versa it can be any Anything could happen with these networks, okay? And don't put all your eggs in one basket, you know, and stuff like that. But that's pretty much it, guys. Thanks for watching.